Hello everyone, in this workflow video, we're going to take a look at Artnet outputs configuration for LED stripe applications. So I've started with a generic 40 inch screen and I've gone for a full HD resolution. And the first thing you want to do is go to the mapping tab and in the live systems you can find your local system or your system within the network depending on your uh, application and if i expand my local system i can now find artnet and right in the inspector you can now add an artnet output now as you can see i can expand this option and i can find my artnet output and this I now want to assign to my image device, which is in my case, my generic 40 inch full HD display. There you go. I've already assigned content on here. So let's assume this is the video I want to play out on my LED stripes. Now let's get back to mapping. And in order to do the configuration, because somehow we now have to, uh, of course, create those stripes and place them. Uh, what we want to do is we want to dive into our screen here in the mapping tab. And all you have to do is just click here or press D on the shortcut. And by diving in here, we can already see there is already one mapping applied. And in that case, it's just the full HD display we are using right now. And now once I select this in the inspector, you can already see we get the name output, which is assigned to our artnet. And we already get DMX patching information down here. Now let's assume our LED stripe is something like four, uh, 400 pixels height and four pixels width, something like this. So quite a small stripe. Um, of course, in a situation like this, most of the time, you are going to use more than only one stripe. And what you can do here now is you can utilize the auto transform editor for auto setup of multiple stripes. So I will just click my auto setup here. And here now can decide between distribute and offset. And in my case, I want to go for distribute. You can hit preview, which will always show um, the setup you're going for. So let's say we have 10 stripes. We start at X1 and end at, I don't know, let's go for 100, for example. And let's hit preview. And we can already see we now got 10 different stripes starting at X coordination zero and then progressing through our setup. Down below, you can also do some DMX setups. Um, there is an address and universe. So I'm starting here at universe uh, zero. And there is also a setting for the footprint. So the footprint is always the amount of pixel times three because Every pixel consists of an RGB signal, of course. So we got four times uh, 400, which is 1600 times three. Um, should be 4,800. And hit apply. And now our stripes are already mapped. And you can see it also down here. We get our starting address for our first stripe at universe zero, start address zero. The second one, as we are actually using 4,800 DMX channels per stripe, we're now at universe nine, starting address 192. Next one, subnet one, universe two. 384. So as you can see, the system auto will automatically, if you set it up like this, patch the stripes for you into progressing DMX universes as well as subnet. 
There we go. Here we now start with Subnet 2, Universe 5, and so on. Thank you for watching and have fun with your Artnet patching applications.